everyone, welcome back to Tri Cat Maria Vlogs. I hope you're doing well today. Today I want to share with you one of our family's favorite things, the Love Every Play Kit subscription. I'm going to be looking at some notes here just so I can make sure I remember all the favorite things that I want to share with you. I'm going to be focusing on the Thinker for 11 to 12 months, the Babbler Kit for 13 to 15 months, and the Adventure for 16 to 18 months. In a couple of weeks, we'll be getting the Realist Play Kit for 19 to 21 months, and we're very excited about that. So what is Love Every? Love Every is a toy company that primarily does Montessori-inspired toy subscription boxes tailored to your child's age and development. And they also have book bundles that you can add on to the play kit. We usually don't do the book bundles, but this next time we will be because the book bundle for 19 to 21 month is about toilet learning. So there's one book for pee, one book for poop. So we definitely want to get that. And the books have real pictures, which is a Montessori thing to use real pictures to help with learning. And let's see, another thing is using natural materials to make the toys. One thing I want to point out is that a lot of times when people think Montessori, they think of beige wooden toys, but it doesn't have to be like that. One thing I love about Love Every is that all the toys are very bright and colorful. So I'll show you the toys here, but you can see all the beautiful colors that they are. If you've seen my social media feeds and also how I dress, then you know that I love colors and it's very important um, to me to share colorful things with Mariana. So they have kids from zero to 12 weeks and under a year, it's every two months and over a year, they have play kits for every three months. And now they go up through month 60. They also have some standalone kits. They just came out with a music set that looks like a lot of fun. And there's a play gym and just wonderful things on their website, which I will link down below. Something else you can get with your play kit subscription is um, the app so you can sign into the app and it gives you all these great activities and milestone lists fun things like that and their website and app have parenting resources that i found very helpful so let me scroll down here just to go to next thing i want to mention is that even at 18 months mariana finds all the toys from even the earlier kids very engaging these Love Every Toys are some of her favorite things and they keep her occupied really well and they're very open-ended and she finds different ways to use the toys that I wouldn't have even thought of. So it's really fun to see how her brain works by watching her play with these toys. Something else that has also helped her really get into the toys is that her favorite YouTuber uses them too. I'll put her channel up. It's Cantonese for Babies and Toddlers. So Mariana can see the toys on the screen and see them in her playpen or in her high chair. So that has also helped the learning process too. That actually helped her um, really get into her baby doll right here, which I'll get into soon. And that's another reason I were really excited for the Realist Play Kit is because we've seen a lot of the toys from that kit in her videos. So now let's get into the kits that we have. Let's start with the Thinker for 11 to 12 months. One thing I want to mention um, as I'm getting into the Thinker specifically, but just in general about the play kits, is that they can change. So if there's one toy in the Thinker play kit that wasn't in there when we first got it, it's a little switchboard. It looks like a lot of fun, but we just missed it. And also there is this toy. I think this came from the Thinker that's not in the kit anymore, but this one, we like to use a lot with her um, toy garden, her um, kitchen set. We use it as her little farmer's market bag. It crinkles on the bottom and she likes to tease along the edge. So something to keep in mind. Also something that you get with the kits is these guides that have developmental information and also DIY activities and little guides on how to use the play things in the kit to the fullest, so we definitely love these guides. But now I wanna focus on the kits specifically. So some of the kits come with books separate from the book bundle. So this is a book for the Thinker Play Kit. As you can see, it's very well loved. This is Animals I See. It's very simple, it just has a picture of the animal and then the word, Mariana loves cats, so she had a lot of fun with this one. 
I definitely have to tape this one again. But here's a book for the Thinker kit. And this one, these are differently weighted. So this is a heavy one. And this one is lighter and squishy. Um, Mariana isn't at, is as interested in this particular toy. She mostly just likes to chew on it. But there's this one, comes with the Thinker. And then this doll came with the Thinker for 11 to 12 months. But it wasn't until closer to 14 months, so she really started to get into dolls. And even now, she's not really like feeding her doll as much or anything, but she does hug and kiss her doll, especially because her favorite YouTuber shows the doll a lot in the videos. So this doll comes in three different skin tones, and this is the one we have. It's organic cotton, and I think it's washable. I hope it is, because she's always chewing on her doll. <laughs> but that's the doll. And this wooden peg drop. So this is for 11 to 12 months, but from what I've heard um, from other parents is that a lot of um, little ones don't usually understand this one fully until a little older. So this slides here like this and then goes like that. So that's how this one works. So now she's really into this toy, but we're still working on the sliding part. So that's that one and then this box she got this one pretty fast and she loves it so much she still plays with it a lot let me double check the website so i know what they say about it one great thing about these toys is they work on fine motor skills object permanence things like that that are really helpful for later on let's see yeah so this one works on strength hand -day coordination and problem solving there's another little puzzle that comes with it. I'll put up a picture of it. That one she has a lot of fun with. I just can't find it. <laughs> but yes, these are the toys from the Thinker Play Kit. So out of all of the play kits that we've received from Love Every so far, our favorite is the Babbler for 13 to 15 months. There are a lot of really fun, colorful toys in this one. First one is this ball tower. It comes with two. There's a pink and yellow one and a green and blue one. And it just goes like that. And then there are different openings on the side. This one is really fun. This one is fabric, different layers for a child to work through. So this one is a lot of fun. What did they say about this one? Okay, this one is a fun lesson object permanence. So that's from the website. So she definitely has a lot of fun with this one. One different way that she uses it is just putting random toys from other play kits or just random objects she finds to see if they fit and see if they slide down or how they slide down. So this one has a lot of uses. It's a lot of fun. Next is the Circle of Friends puzzle. So that's what this one's called. And different sizes helps them work on fine motor skills and also see pictures of other children. She has a lot of fun with this one. And there's the wooden stacker. So something about stacking ring toys is that they usually have an added challenge with them. She has another stacking ring toy that slides on the bottom, like kind of rocks a little bit. This one is more flexible. I think it's also a safety measure to have it flexible. But this actually comes with two sets of rings. I usually just have one set out at a time. Oh, she has a lot of fun with this one. This one's also in her YouTube videos a lot, too. And one of her favorite, favorite toys is this carrot box. It's also a coin box. So the bottom is magnetic, and I have the coins in there right now. She loves these wooden coins. And this is the lid for the coin box. And this is the lid for the carrot box. And I'll show you the carrots. So it comes with five carrots and five coins. And it's a really fun activity. Right now I'm also trying to teach her how to take the bottom off herself. I think she's almost there. Somehow she figured out how to take these off. Sometimes I even have trouble getting these lids off. It also comes with another lid. I'll put up a picture here. It comes with a set of three lids. And then this activity, it's another fine motor skill activity. And along with this slot, 
the um, Velcro bugs from the bug shrub and the next kit that I'll show you also fit in here. So she had fun figuring that out. And this set comes with a book. So this play kit has the Bedtime for Zoe book. This is definitely one of her favorites. We leave most of her books pretty accessible to her. Only the board books, the paper books we keep on a shelf away from her. But this is in her little book bin and she's always picking this one out. It's definitely a very fun book. And then let me see, there's one more. The Felt Burrow Bunnies. So it comes with three bunnies. She's always chewing on them, but it's a very cute little bag. And she puts other toys into the burrow too. So definitely a lot of uses with this one. And sometimes when I get her play kitchen food stuff out, I put the bunnies in the play food. So she makes rabbit stew a lot too. <laughs> but that's the Babbler kit. And I wanna show you the Adventurer. So the Adventurer play kit is for 16 to 18 months. And this one is really fun because it has an outdoorsy theme. So the book that comes with this play kit is Max and Nana Go to the Park. So this one is a lot of fun. It's about managing and processing emotions. They have a little bit about that and how you can teach that lesson in the guide that comes with this play kit. But this is the book. It also has this um, wooden pegboard. There are more pegs that come with it. I, only, I just have four out right now, but they can stack on top of each other and then there are different little openings. So this one's a lot of fun. She's not as into it yet, but she does like this one. And next we have the racetrack. I was very excited about this one when I saw this one online. It comes with two little cars, red and blue. And then the, uh oh, <laughs> and then the racetrack itself is red and blue. She has a lot of fun with this one. It. it's pretty tall and then the garden puzzle this is similar to the circle of friends puzzle works on fine motor skills this one she uses it a little differently she uses the circle of friends puzzle as intended but this one she likes to take the shovel and then pretend to eat the other pieces and then she takes the pieces out and she puts them in the little bag she puts them in here so that's fun but I love the colors in this one there's a carrot an onion a cabbage I think that's the purple onion and then a shovel so that's this one and the bug shrub so the bug shrub pieces fit into the coin box there are six bugs in here but we're missing two of them she recently started shoving remotes under the sofa, so the bugs are probably somewhere weird. But there are six bugs. There's a ladybug, a dragonfly, and there's a caterpillar, there's an ant. I think there's a bee and a butterfly. So we're missing the bee and the butterfly. But this is great in practice taking it on, putting it on, taking it off. So this is great activity. Also great for the high chair because it's pretty contained. Um, the pegboard and the stocking ring set, also the coin box slash carrot box, that's your high chair activity too. So let me see, oh, there is another one. I think this is the last one, the threadable bead kit. And this drawstring bag you can use for other purposes too, which is a lot of fun. And this is the threadable bead kit. They've changed the beads since we got the kit. Um, the, these are a different shape now but it comes with different sizes, shapes, colors of beads. She has a lot of fun with this one. Let me see what they say about this one on the website. I think my laptop wants me to sign in again. It keeps doing that. Unless it died. Nope, it didn't die. Okay, so this one, the threadable bead kit. So this is a fine motor activity where they can practice using both hands. Then you have to hold it up to put the beads on. This one she has a lot of fun with. But that's everything for the Adventurer Kit. And now I just want to share some general last thoughts. Overall, we've had a very positive experience with Love Every's Play Kit subscription. 
and I still love that it takes the guesswork out of picking Montessori toys for her age. So if you're interested in the Montessori method for your young child, or if you're just looking for toys made of natural materials, I definitely recommend Love Every. I'm very excited for the next kits to come in the subscription and for the standalone sets like the music set and um, the block set. Very excited about those. And a little stroller for her baby doll. So lots of fun stuff to check out. And let's end this video with a prayer to ask God for guidance in educating our children. Let's ask for the intercession of our mother. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Ghost, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Ghost, Amen. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. Subscribe for more traditional Catholic and natural mama content. And events already, you can check out my link tree down below with all of my social media pages and some of my favorite resources. And if you have used Love Every or other Montessori style toys, you can comment down below and share your experiences too. Also, I do take video requests and things like that, so you can comment those down below as well. Thank you so much for watching this video and God bless you.